morning everyone so in this video we are going to learn here one more question from the chapter some applications of trigonometry and the question here is a vertical pole is turns on the level ground from a point on the ground 25 meter away from the foot of the pole the angle of elevation of its top is found to be 60 degree find the height of the pole so since we can see here a vertical pole is turns on the level ground so on a level ground a pole is standing vertically that means this is the level ground and this is the pole which is standing on the level ground vertically from a point on the ground so this is the point on the ground so you have marked this point as a and this point is 25 meter away from the foot of the pole so from a point on the ground 25 meter away from the foot of the pole so the point here is 25 meter away from the foot of the pole and the point is considered as a so it is 25 meter the angle of elevation of its top is found to be 60 degree and the angle of elevation from the point to the top of the pole is 60 degree so you can see here the angle is 60 degree then find the height of the pole then what will be the height of the pole so if we consider this height of the pole as h then we need to find the value of h so since h is mentioned and the base ab is also mentioned as 25 meter from this diagram we can see that we need to find the height of the pole that means the value of h and the base is here a b is 25 so first we will consider h with the height of the pole so let h be the height of the pole and the base mentioned here is a b is equal to 25 meter so a b is equal to 25 meter be the distance between the point and the foot of the pole and the angle theta is also mentioned here and theta is equal to 60 degree be the angle of elevation so from this diagram you can see here if we consider the angle as theta then this h is directly opposite to theta so we can consider this h as the opposite side and ab as the base of the triangle so we can say that o and b is mentioned o means opposite side and b is the base so opposite side and base is mentioned and if we compare with the trigonometric ratio so tan theta is included with this opposite side and base so from this triangle so you can see here opposite side and base is there so opposite side and base includes the ratio tan theta so opposite side by base is equal to tan theta so you can take here tan theta so tan theta is equal to opposite side is h and base is 25 so you can write here h by 25 and since it's uh, theta is equal to 60 degrees the angle is 60 degree here so instead of writing theta we'll write here 60 degree is equal to h by 25 and we know that the value of tan 60 degree is root over 3 so instead of writing root over uh, instead of writing 60 degree we'll write root over 3 is equal to h by 25 now if we cross multiply h with 1 in the denominator of the left hand side and root over 3 with 25 will get h into 1 is h equal to 25 into root over 3 is 25 root over 3 so since this is the value of h so we are here about to find the value of h and this h is the height of the pole so this is the height of the pole so if you are not subscribed to this channel then please subscribe it and if especially you are from Meghalaya and you are a student of class 10 then please subscribe this channel so that I can bring some more questions for you. Thanks for watching.